27 June 1889 in Lia Louis, the capital of Belosland. Lewanika, the king of Belosland, was seeking British protection over his kingdom. Because he feared the Portuguese in the west, the Germans in the southwest, Lombongula in the south, and also internal three. Therefore, in 1889, rumors secreted Barozan that the Metavili army was planning to invade the Barozi kingdom. This tactic seems to have been generated by the white seeking concession from Lewanika. The white concession seekers knew Lewanika's desire for British protection. In this episode, we look at the series of events that led to Lewanika into granting mineral concession to anywhere which were called the Ware Concession. How are you, Your Majesty, King Lewanika of Balozlan? I'm very grateful for allowing your council to meet you. I am not very well, Mr. Ware. I'm really puzzled right now. What is it, Your Majesty, that is making you not to be very well? This morning, I was informed by my Induna that the Matebere army are planning to invade my kingdom. Indeed, Your Majesty, your kingdom not only at least at risk of being invaded by the Matebere army, but can also be invaded by the Portuguese in the west and also Germans in the southwest of your kingdom. Mi Mr. Ware, even what I'm holding in my hand, called Papayakuo in Lozi, which defines my authority, cannot stop my kingdom from being invaded. <laughs> Your Majesty, you made me to laugh. Mr. Ware, you don't have manners. I'm talking with you and you are laughing. Anyway, it's time to talk business now. Your Majesty, I am the best person to help you to protect your kingdom from being invaded. You are now talking, my boy. How are you going to help me to protect my kingdom? Your Majesty, in order for me to help you to protect your kingdom, I have proposed that I am going to supply you with guns and I also train your men on how to use the guns. And in return, I am requesting you to grant me mineral concession over your kingdom. So, Mr. Ware, you want me to grant you mineral concession in exchange for only guns? Your Majesty, apart from giving you the guns, I also pay you 10% of the mineral profit annually and also pay you mineral royalty amounting to 200 pounds per year. The deal sounds good, Mr. Ware, but how can I trust you? As you are aware, Your Majesty, I'm representing Her Majesty, the Queen of Great Britain, so you should trust me. Okay, Mr. Ware, I've accepted the deal, but under two conditions. I will grant you mineral concession outside the Barozi Kingdom proper, and the mineral right will only last up to 20 years. 
That's a great deal, your majesty. And I promise to fulfill the obligation of the agreement. Finally, an agreement was reached on 27th June 1889 called the Ware Concession. The Ware Concession granted Henry Ware to explore mineral concession outside the Barrows and proper. It was also agreed that 10% of the mineral profit to be paid to the king annually, plus 200 pounds to be paid to the king annually, and the mineral concession were to last only for 20 years. Signed by Lewanika, the king of the Barossi, signed by Henry Ware.